What is up guys? Let's go fishing back with another video. So all these YouTubers right now are doing their best moments of um 2017. So I might as well do one just because I have I think around like 60 or so videos. Um so we're going to I'm just going to go through them. I'll probably pick my five favorite and since Zach's not here, I'll probably pick one of his favorites cuz I definitely know he caught like two PBs in the video. So we'll show you five videos the best moments of 2017. And yeah, it's been it's almost been a year since this channel has been created. So thanks a lot for um all of you guys like watching my videos and everything. So yeah, let's just get straight into the video with um my number five well um best moment of 2017. So this is probably um, the greatest moment. This was like one of the biggest fish I've like caught like in the beginning of the year. I'm pretty sure this was like maybe a little bit of March. So you see me like trying to reach into the fish's mouth, but um, it was just a great moment. It we ha um now that like I, I actually look at it, it's a it's a it's a decent sized carp, maybe like nine pounds. It's like huge. It's a huge carp. My friend Dylan caught it. That was like his first fish, first first freshwater fish of the year. It was a great video. Um, it was a great video. Um, 113 views. So it, it was just a great video. And the reason why I'm doing it on this computer is because I don't have any of the footage left because I just delete everything off my um phone. So he gets a nice release on it, and it was just a great video overall. I um I overreact so much in this video. So, yeah, if you guys want to go check it out, all these videos will be linked in the description if you want to go watch them later. So, guys, probably my second favorite, you could see me in the screen because it is the next morning. Probably my second favorite moment is this, is we went on a charter boat and um, we caught, like, it wasn't it wasn't a good day to go because it rained the night before, so the bottom was all murky, and we all we caught so we caught like huge fish. So this was this was probably the best moment of it, even though I didn't catch it. This was a 38 pound striped bass. My friend's dad caught this. It was absolutely huge, like huge. Everybody on the boat was going crazy. It was a huge striped bass, and yeah, and. And then we'll go to the next clip of me actually putting uh, putting my hand on it because of how big it is. It was actually 38 when they weighed it later. But, yep, that is my hand. Two of my hands could have fit like on the thing. It was it was just a huge fish. So that is my the fourth best moment of. And I'm gonna count down, so this is the fourth best. We have three more to go. Okay. Okay, guys, so this video has to be in one of the top charts. So this was when we went um, surf fishing in um, Wildwood Crest. Um, we actually, we, we honestly didn't think we were gonna catch anything. We brought some squid, chicken, shrimp. We caught some of these, um, um, I wanna say these were kingfish right here. Um, like, you can literally see how far it is from the beach in the background. Like, I'm pretty sure this right here was our hotel. Like, I'm almost positive that was our hotel. We literally walked straight out, and we caught, like, a lot of fish, surprisingly. And then, like, at the end of the video, let it load quickly. Look at all those seagulls. There was definitely something going on that day. Like, we caught sharks and look at all these seagulls like that should like that's crazy there must have been a huge bunker thing out there so let's just get into the part where it got it it got very interesting right here i catch this shark i'm like we, i thought i thought it was like but it was different this bite was very different it was just a strong tug okay a very very strong tug it was just the biggest bite i've ever felt and it just it after that it, i didn't feel like anything but the bite was like so strong at like and then that same day some guy got bit so that after that we didn't go in the water and thank god that was the last day because i would have never went in the water after we caught like seven or eight sharks so as you guys know my friend zach recently just joined the channel maybe like two months ago and we actually since he is not here i will probably I, I can like easily pick his favorite moment of 2017 he called his personal best bass and two humongous channel catfish like for this pond it's like 
they should not even be in there. They're just so big. Like, now it's getting to a point where we're, we're going fishing, like, together more than I actually go fishing by myself. Like, because you don't want to go there and just, like, just, like, not go with anybody. It's just boring. So, that, so Zach is in the channel, so I will show you he probably... I could probably send him a message right now and tell him, what, oh, what's your favorite video that you were in? And I can easily pick that one out. So, yep, you probably, you guys probably know which video I'm going in. Um, it was actually this video. It was, um, it was just me laying down very much. But, it's actually... Well, there was two parts. Um, this one was was better. So, so just to get it, Zach catches this um small catfish, and we thought this one was gonna be like the only one we caught that day. It was literally like a pound. Okay, so nothing really special. Then, then Zach catches. So then we're like freaking out because it's a huge bass, and he ends up catching his personal best bass, which is like. Which is actually, like, it's pretty good. Like, when you catch your personal ba um, personal best bass in a day, it's normally a good day of fishing. And it was, I, wa I, I want to say it's a little bit more than three pounds. Like, maybe, like, four. Because of the way, like, hold on. You have to see, that, like, just the way that mouth is, that fish was pretty big. So, it has to be a little bit more than um four. Then we'll get into the next part where, you know... <laughs> We caught, I catch his tiny brown head, and at this point of the video, we're literally about to leave, and Zach's, Zach, you know, throws his rod out, catches this catfish right here, four pounds, okay, wow, biggest, that's his biggest channel catfish ever, that's the, probably the biggest catfish I've ever seen in there, it was, it might have been six pounds, like, literally this catfish was huge, then I get a bite on my rod, and then, and then I'm reeling it in. It comes off. So, whatever. Then we're gonna get to this next part where, once again, he he's like. Hold on. Then we'll get to the next clip. I'm trying to find it right here. This is the same video. I'm like Zach. Look at your rod. And he's like, guys, it's another monster. And guess what? It was another monster. He ends up catching. Hold on, I'm trying to get to the point. Right here. Zach catches an eight pound catfish. And then the, the, cause it's, this is a nature center. So the guy goes fishing a lot. So that was just a striped bass just he brought. But Zach catches an eight pound catfish. I'll show you a picture of that in another clip. Like a better picture. But these two catfish that he caught were huge. Like that angle, not really good. To show how big it is, I couldn't wrap my hand around it. Like, if you can grab your hand around the fish, you know it's kind of small. This one, I couldn't even reach my hand around. It was so big. This was a great fishing video. Okay, guys, so this was the first one he caught. It wasn't that big. But then, we'll get on to the second one, which was absolutely huge. Um, For a catfish that size in that pond, not likely. Like, it was so big, it probably was eating bluegill. Like, like live bluegill. The mouth was huge. This was, this was just a huge catfish. Um, and then, um, it was, I, I, it was great. And then that's his head, that's the head of the personal best bass. I didn't get the whole body, but it was, when I say it was a huge fish, it was a huge fish. And you have to believe me on that. So, he caught two personal bests in one day. Okay, guys, so for the last and final um, favorite best moment of 2017, um, it's actually when I went tog fishing in Brooklyn. Um, we weren't expecting to catch that many because, like, it is kind of rare to catch some blackfish. We caught a three that day. We did do a catch and cook because um, we didn't catch some huge, um, we caught some big blackfish here. So at this point of the video, I catch, like, a 10-pound blackfish. And there's the mate, like, going, like, because it's a little kid catching, like, a, a big blackfish. And it's not like, oh, they're, um, it's a, it's a decent-sized blackfish. It was, I have to say, it was, like, 10 pounds. It was pretty big. So, um, when I caught this, um, the bite, it was, it was there by the shark, but the blackfish fights so hard. The bite is nothing. 
but the fight the um the fight that it puts up it could probably put up like um maybe like a small i have no clue i can you can't even describe how hard it fights for the size it's incredible like it'll be this will be one of the like best fights you'll ever get like this for this for me was like intense so the whole day everybody was catching fish um yeah i could go to like any point of the video and someone has to be catching a fish like there's me getting another big bite and like oh look another guy's getting another um another black fish so right there we were on a reef off the shore of brooklyn and we caught like a ton of fish that day but a lot of them were like 15 inches i caught one that was like 15 inches and it had to be 16 but we had to throw it back because like there's not that many black fish so we had to throw it back so this was this was definitely one of the best moments um, um, 27. Okay, guys, so that is actually it for the video. Um, 2017's been a great year. Done a lot of fishing. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Really, we might do another video. I doubt we're going to do another video, um, this two days. Because it is New Year's Eve. So, Happy New Year to all you guys. And hope you guys had a great Christmas. Um, yeah, and that is really it for today's video. Let's go fishing out.